In March 2019 in Egypt, a team of dedicated archaeologists was excavating an ancient burial ground that had been the resting place of early pharaohs for thousands of years. Hidden beneath tombs and pyramids, the sprawling necropolis of Saqqara had safeguarded its contents from public view as dynasties rose and fell. Despite the passage of time, the researchers persisted in their efforts and made an extraordinary discovery. The archaeologists uncovered a remarkably preserved tomb, estimated to be 4,000. 400 years old, adorned with beautifully crafted paintings. Saqqara had been a site of interest for excavators since the 19th century, with many seeking relics from the fascinating history of the region. Originally, during Egypt's first dynasty, the nobles were laid to rest here, indicating the vast historical significance hidden beneath the arid and rocky ground. In July 2018, the excavation at Saqqara gained significant attention when a gilded burial mask was unearthed, marking the beginning of a series of notable discoveries. Several months later, in March 2019, the researchers stumbled upon a tomb in an astonishing state of preservation despite its ancient age. While modern impressions of ancient Egypt often revolve around iconic landmarks like the Pyramids of Giza and the Great Sphinx, it's essential to recognize that the Egyptian kingdom once extended over much of the Nile Valley, making it a dominant civilization in the Mediterranean for nearly three millennia. The reign of Egypt's first pharaoh began around 3100 BC, initiating the first dynasty. Subsequent dynasties ruled the ancient kingdom until it became part of the Roman Empire in the first century BC. Throughout their reign, the pharaohs showcased their immense wealth through elaborate and ornate tombs, many of which are still being discovered today. As mentioned earlier, Saqqara has been a treasure trove of ancient artifacts, located just a short drive south of the famed Giza Pyramid complex and associated with Memphis, the capital of ancient Egypt. Memphis thrived on the banks of the River Nile and reached its peak with an estimated population of 30,000 inhabitants, making it the most populous settlement of its time. The necropolis of Saqqara, extending over four miles in length and nearly a mile in width, contains the tombs and monuments of numerous pharaohs, holding spiritual significance throughout the ages. Although Saqqara has been explored since the 19th century, early excavations were mirrored by looting and illegal artifact removal, resulting in the loss of priceless relics. The famous Pyramid of Djoser is among the prominent structures in Saqqara, dating back to the 27th century BC and considered the world's oldest intact stone building complex. Over the years, more than 35 tombs were discovered at Saqqara between 1982 and 1986, with subsequent excavations revealing further wonders from the ancient burial ground. In July 2018, an astonishing find was made a rare burial mask crafted from gilded silver. Later, in December 2018, another tomb from around 4,400 years ago was discovered, featuring remarkably preserved sculptures and paintings. Continuing their efforts, an expedition near the Saqqara necropolis, led by Mohammed Magd from the Sheikh Institute of Archaeology, announced a significant discovery on April 13, 2019. The burial chambers found at this location were believed to date from the 5th dynasty, around 4,000 years ago, during the reign of Pharaoh Userkaf, unveiling a fascinating chapter in Egypt's history. Around the mid-24th century BC, the 5th dynasty of ancient Egypt came to an end, marking a period that lasted approximately 150 years. During this time, a team of archaeologists, led by Magad, made significant discoveries near Saqqara. They located several tombs from the 5th dynasty, as well as an intriguing granite column dedicated to Queen Satipar, the wife of King Jetgarasisi, one of the last rulers of the dynasty. However, the most thrilling find was announced at a conference attended by numerous officials, where Egyptian antiquities minister, Colette Alanani, revealed the discovery of another tomb dating back to March 2019. This tomb, believed to be over 4,000 years old, was remarkably well-preserved. The wall paintings inside appeared fresh and vibrant, as though they were recently painted. 
The tomb was likely that of a man named Kaui, an official from the 5th dynasty. Kaui's tomb followed an L-shaped design, featuring a small corridor leading to an antechamber, and then a larger chamber adorned with painted reliefs depicting Kaui seated at an offerings table. The tomb's architectural style, inspired by the pyramids of the 5th dynasty, hinted at the occupant's potential importance. The use of royal hues and distinct green resin in the paintings further added to the intrigue. Although Kawi's exact role remains uncertain, it is speculated that he may have had a close relationship with King Jedkarasisi, the ruler known for reigning for 44 years or more. King Jedkar deviated from tradition by foregoing the construction of a temple dedicated to the sun god Ra and instead focused on expeditions to Sinai for precious metals and goods. Additionally, the expansion of ancient Egypt into the territory of Canaan is associated with his reign. King Jedkar implemented significant reforms, centralizing power and creating a feudal-like system across ancient Egypt. However, modern historians question the effectiveness of these changes. The Fifth Dynasty of Ancient Egypt, which lasted for approximately 150 years until the mid-24th century BC, underwent significant reforms under the rule of Pharaoh Jedkarasesi. These changes affected not only the Egyptian government, but also the funerary cults of the time. Governing burial protocols and rituals believed to ensure a safe passage into the afterlife. Jedkarasesi's reforms led to him being revered even after his death, and his tomb, marked by a stepped pyramid over 170 feet tall, stood in Saqqara. Unfortunately, the tomb fell victim to looters before excavation began in the 1940s, leaving much of the fifth dynasty ruler's life shrouded in mystery. The recent discovery of Kawi's tomb near Saqqara may shed light on Jedkar Asizi's life and his potential relationship with the official. The elaborate burial suggests a possible close connection between the two, leading some to speculate about a family link. The tomb's lavish decor could be evidence of the reforms implemented by Jedkar Asisi. The site attracted international attention, with dignitaries, cultural representatives, and even Egyptian singer and actress Yasra visiting and posing for photographs alongside the stunning discoveries. The Egyptian government hopes that such archaeological findings will encourage tourists to return to the country as the tourism industry suffered a significant blow following political unrest in 2011. After the revolution, the tourist industry faced hardships, but with the recovery, more than 11 million people visited Egypt as a tourist destination in a subsequent year. Recent years have witnessed a wealth of historic discoveries from the region, and authorities are optimistic that these findings, including those at Saqqara, will help revive tourism in the country. The fascination with ancient Egypt remains strong, as seen by the popularity of the Ministry of Antiquities photographs from inside Kawi's tomb, and the hope is that these discoveries will continue to allure tourists to the remarkable history and sites of Egypt. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe.